Hello. Okay, so we want to shut him down. I don't want to try and take the chance of getting the control. I might get a lot more on it, but I'm just not going to take the chance on it. Um, I, yeah, I could have took control of him, but... Again, sometimes it's better just to shut him down for a couple of turns. Get rid of that overwatch so I can at least move units. Um... Okay, so he comes back. Okay, you're going to come in, and I should be able to actually take a couple of shots at this guy from one of these directions. I'm just trying to think which one it'll be. What's over there? Hello, let's burn you. Who's got the blue screen rounds? It's you, isn't it? Oh, it ended his turn. That's really annoying, that is. It's left him in the fucking open. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is going to be an absolute nightmare to deal with now. Okay, so I could take a shot at Mr. Bozo right here, but it's missing by a massive margin. I could take a pistol, but won't kill him, potentially. Um... Yeah, this is, this is awkward as hell. Ideally, I want to take a shot on him. Although I've knocked him out, though, so I can move. So at least I won't get the fire, but I don't want to draw fire away from him. Okay. If I blow a hole in that, I'll be able to actually shoot out. I didn't realise my turn would get ended, though. That's the only thing where the position I'm in right now. Um, it'd be better actually doing shot damage on him, but I can't knock him down. And I blew all this cover up, so I don't have position to be able to go anywhere else. Um, which is kind of a bit frustrating. Um, so I need to be in cover in order to be able to shoot. That rocket won't go through there. Even if I run off this way. Oh, I'm so screwed where I am right now. I could go for the window, I guess. And then fire from that window through to that other window. Will that work? Can't fire through this way. Oh, that, that is going to fucking just pound me into the ground. Yeah, so I won't be able to get to him from there. Okay, maybe beacon out. I think that's probably the better option here. Draw some fire, hopefully. So hopefully it doesn't trigger them. That's the only thing I'm concerned about. Uh, okay, can I... Come on. There we go. Let's get the Mimic out. Probably the better option to pull her back. Because uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to kill him. Uh, the thing is, is like it's weird that I can do the more damage at range. And he's got a 49% chance. I obviously can hit him with a pistol. But the pistol might not kill him. So I'm just going to have to pull off. Um, and then just launch a grenade at him and just knock him down. Um, there we go. So he's down now. Hey. Um, you can come, I think, around this way. Just hide. <laughs> hide in the doorways. Okay, and then you, I guess, can come here and just fire some aid protocol <laughs> off. Um, that's all I can really do. I've got to try and protect now um, him, who's kind of like, I didn't realise his turn would end, otherwise I would have moved him. 
Okay, so he's got threat assessment as well, at least. So if the, the robot moves, it'll take a couple of shots. Oh. Alright. Okay, there's the other codex and the alien. So, we've got to blue screen him. Wow. Yeah, that blue screen round worked fantastically. <laughs> uh. Okay, so missed the damage, but I got at least two on him, so that's fine. Uh, I wonder if he's going to take the shot off at... Where's he going to shoot at? Yes. Brilliant. That is fine. I'll take that. Okay, so. Move up. So they're all the way over there, at Faceless. He's down there. I guess take a pistol shot at him from there, which is kind of nice. Wow, critical. Five damage. He's kind of in a bit of open there, but I want to see where this codex is. Um, so, best option, move him up. All right, I'll go. Okay, so the codex is there. I can actually throw out a grenade and try and move them. I guess they fire a fire grenade at him. So if we can try and avoid civilian casualties, that'd be great. Yeah, so if I move the codex, I'll be able to then take a shot. Ideally, I'd want to try and destroy his cover. And then I'd be able to shoot him, but he's in he's got heavy cover sat there. Um, Heading there now. Okay, let's do a pistol on you. you got a pistol on him, a pistol on him. Well, I'd rather get rid of the elite trooper. Because at least then that deals one less damage coming my way. Um, he can come out and just fire off some shots, I think. So I put him at, at least any point I think on here is fine. To position. Puts me in at least some sort of cover. Uh, I could go straight for the sectoid. I could try and go for him. Ideally, the combat protocol will be used for that. Um... Can I come around this way? Oh, I can. And I'll probably have to get a couple of shots off on him. I'm going. Ooh, that might be good. I mean, the grenade launcher would be probably better on that one. Um, I'm just trying to think what's the better option here. Do damage on both of them, and then be able to kill one off and deal with a, that next turn. To see where the codex goes. Yeah, let's just do that. Get the grenade. Miss the civilian. Oh, I actually got rid of his cover. Brilliant. So I can focus the fire on him now. It'll disappear. It won't be as much to kill now. Oh, you son of a... That is absolute BS. Okay, um, I do have a combat protocol. I can only use it on people I can see, though. And I would have used it on him, uh, if possible, which sucks. Uh, why can I not see you from there? On Overwatch. Go for the codex. Guess tech him out. <sighs> Missed. Get it together. That's not ideal. Ooh, I, oh no! Oh, I can. Hold on. I can, handle I can save my my friend. <laughs> I forgot I had Ray, RJ. RJ, come save the day, please. Yes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, 
Thank you, RJ. Okay, so he should do a mind control, or he should do a... Oh, that mech's no longer shut down. Shit. He's get... Oh, he gets a fucking turn as well. That's a bit BS, that is. I feel like if you come back from a shutdown on your turn, you shouldn't be able to uh, do anything. That's killed him, so that's fine. So we've just got the mech to worry about and him. So he's going to teleport out that way, which is not ideal. Is he going for a shot? Yep. Oh, no, he's going for the, uh, the bomb. Which isn't the worst. Okay. Right, so uh, action points here. Um, mech needs destroying. That's probably the biggest one right now. So, where is my mech dude? So, if I move him up to there, it covers me. And then I'll be able to just point blank shoot him with a weapon. Um, although, I need to reload though, which is a bit. Although, he's slightly in cover. his armor which is the biggest one that I'm gonna to have to deal with um, he can drain his cover and then shoot him but um, let's see what we can do here so you can move up to here for a pistol shot okay so that could deal some damage you can take shots on both of them but 98 on him now if I could strip his armor that'd be great so it might be the better option right now. Throw a couple of grenades his way. I'm going. Okay, so. Oh, are you kidding me? I just can't get him. Are, are you... Mm, look at that. Right. The armor needs stripping, so that's something that has to go. Um, he's... You can take a shot, but can't do the damage. You're just chilling over there, but you're going to have to run. Um, he's got free reload, though, so I could actually move him to a free reload and just take the shot out of him from the back, um, which might be the better option there. Because he won't be in cover. Whatever you say. And that's the fun thing about free reloads. Um... Gets rid of him, and then it's basically B line to. Uh... See that one? Okay, he's in not in cover. So if I move to there, uh, I'm going. Right, let's just get rid of some of this armor. Let's do some damage on him. Okay, it's three to four. So I got four damage. Pistol him. I want to do one damage. It seems pointless. Um, sniper would actually do a bit of damage. It's ninety-eight percent chance of hitting as well. So it's like, why would you not? And then just use the blue screen mouse to finish him off, I guess. That's the combat protocol. Would actually go through that. What's that? Seven to eight. What's the chance of hitting him? 92. 10 to 12. Or oh, combat. Oh, let's go for the end. Do the shot. Hopefully didn't regret that. <laughs> okay, so I got the shot off. That's fine. Evidence located. Moving to Overwatch. Right, now the big deal is getting up there. Um, faceless is there, but I can run up from this side, which is fine. Okay, let's throw some heals out. Okay, get to the jammer. Now we're going to run to the right and try and get ourselves into some decent position here. So we've got four turns after this. It might just be run for the exit and not worry about the damage. Um, okay. Target package secured. 
Okay. Down that way. Okay, so we've, we've triggered them, which is not ideal. Ugh. Yeah, something I could have done without that, but that's fine. Uh, rocket launcher, I could just plow straight over there and just deal damage onto them, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to have to keep running up. There is another one. There's three in total, which is a bit awkward. Well, he's actually in good position there to take a bit of a... Ooh, hold on. Oh, that's a shame. I could move up a little bit more. And throw an incendiary grenade and just burn them both. Although the damage on him might be just worth it. Um, could actually just move up to there and get a bit closer. So let's do that. I need to see where the other one is. Can I burn them both from this? There. That would get them both and burn them. There we go. So it'll do about two to three damage each turn, which is fine. Um, Hello. Bring in the pain. Boom. <laughs> that rocket from distance is just nuts. Okay. So I could actually fire shots. Oh, I could actually get shot on him from there. That seems fine, actually. Try and see him get rid of him then. Nice. So he's down. Now it's just a beeline it up. Although I've kind of destroyed my way up to the top there, haven't I? Shit. I'm on it. Um, I don't know. Can I? I can still get up, actually. I think. Yes. Just not in the way I want to. Okay, let's just get out of here then. Let's get down. Seems doable. Because we need to run now. This is the big thing. We've got so a little turn left. Overwatch. There we go. So that's fine doesn't trigger overwatch when he does it which is a bit of a shame but it's just that point that i can move um yeah i'm just gonna run oh i can actually still get up there which is good then okay can you get up there you can Although he can jump up though, which is my only concern right now is that faceless. Um, Whatever you say. On your order. Okay, so he's close enough. He's gonna have to beeline it. Why the walking? I don't quite understand that motion. He's there. Is it clear? You're gonna have to just come down. Could do a lot of damage on him, but the problem is, is that I need to move first, so I haven't got time. I can maybe absorb the hits and just do that way. Solid copy. Yeah, let's just uh, get the shots off on him. Try and get rid of this faceless if possible.
Okay, he's down. Big deal. I need ammo. Will do. Okay, you can just run up there now, get you up top. Basically just run now for the exit. So he's going to move. I just want to see where he's going to move to. Hopefully not to the VIP. It'd be nice. Oh, so he's dropped down. So he's overwatching. Okay. Who could take the overwatch damage? There's some things I like end turns, so it's like that's an end turn ability. Um, that's not. So I'm just trying to see who could. I think he could take the damage, and it'd be fine. Um, or I could move him and then just no, because I don't need to throw a grenade at him. I can just do the yeah. Let's just get out really. On the move. There we go. Go. Okay, so we need to get up high now. So let's get the VIP out so we know that she's gone. Run, a VIP, run! VIP so that's the mission done. This is VIP is secure. Moving to position. Okay, get up. Just I d again, I don't want to fire shots unless I can actually deal with them. That's the thing. Um, Will do. Covering now. Can I get up round the back? No, so I can only go up the top, which is a bit awkward. So I don't want to be too exposed with her. So let's go there. He can just jump up top anyway, so that's fine. Going up. And just use him as Overwatch kind of trigger. On Overwatch. I'm worried about that blowing up. To be honest, that's what I'm kind of like. Get everyone up top quick. <laughs> Cause it's on fire at that point. I don't know what at what level that'll actually go. Scanning. Okay, so he's going straight into Overwatch, which is fine to be honest. Alright, 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 I'm going. Right, let him trigger the Overwatch. Oh. But they got the armor protections, that's fine. Come on, let's get you out of there. Off. Okay. I can handle that. Heading out. Okay, we're just in the nick of time. <laughs> There we go, done. So we killed 16 out of 17. We've got three wounded, but excellent rating. We've got the VIP, so we've got the intel and the, also the engineer. Nice.